some areas, signs of a lack of pride in community spirits aren't hard to spot. And it's probably no coincidence that these places also have a much higher crime rate. But a new kind of police initiative in the area means that things are beginning to change. As part of what's called the crime and grime agenda, the police, local residents and various council services get together to work out how to clean up some of the more visible signs of crime and neglect. Of course we investigate crime and deal with crime, but we also look very closely at the environment and try and keep the environment uh, as well maintained as possible. Mend those broken windows quickly, remove that graffiti quickly, take away debris that's been dumped, take away abandoned vehicles, and what that does is it raises the status of the area, it gives people more pride in the area, and it makes people feel safer. As well as cleaning up graffiti and other signs of crime, the street pride teams also mend pavements and make sure lights are working so that residents feel safe. The clean-up days also give locals a chance to have a direct say in the issues and services that affect them. And little by little, that's helping to create a new sense of community. What we try to do is we try to get all sections of the community to play a part in uh, shaping how services are delivered so that they understand the processes uh, and they can appreciate what's being done for them. That way people start to take ownership, have confidence and so it snowballs uh, and we get uh, developing and sustainable communities. Mm.